Let's see, where's my window? Oh, here it is. Now, where's my other window? Okay. So, while we wait on that, my hair is a little wrecked, but who cares? While we wait on that, I'm just going to mess around with Snock 3 Air. Should only be a couple minutes. I'll probably need to turn on desktop audio. That would probably be good. You're playing the beta Android port of this today. Oh yeah, I forgot that existed. Uh, so yeah, just playing this for a few minutes until the direct starts. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. It's pretty cool, this. I mean, I haven't streamed it in an official capacity, and I probably will not <laughs> do so in the future, but it is pretty neat. Isn't there, like, an emerald over here? <laughs> Hang on, I gotta... Not in this area. Oh, so it's the area that looks like this. Ah, yes, of course. They all... they all look so... same. Gotta get to Eggman for the direct start. Yeah, we gotta... we gotta foreshadow properly. I like the fact that you can make it play the Sonic 3 jingles in the Sonic 3 half of the game. That is enjoyable to me. Also, I got a little mod here that gives Tails actual Sonic 3 styled sprites. I don't know if you ever noticed before, but in vanilla Sonic 3, Tails just uses his Sonic 2 sprites. And now that you've seen that, you will not be able to unsee it. About five minutes till the direct starts. Okay, so it's here. Hang on. It. Oh boy, it's Blue Sphere. Hello, Kovar. I mean, I don't expect anybody to watch it, like, this way if they don't want to. I'm mostly just doing it to catalog my own reactions. Now, why am I doing that? I, I don't know. But I am. The Sonic 30th game is Blue Sphere 2. Ugh. I mean, I still like Blue Sphere, but Lord, did, did Mania kind of tire me out on it. I, I had never been so happy to see a pinball table. Well, hey man, do what you want to do. I like. I'm not gonna tell you how to live your life. Basically, you know, if you wanna, if you wanna watch it this way, then more power to you.
I mean, heck, if you just want the if you just want the chat open, I, I don't even mind. Oh, <laughs> Oh, yeah. yeah, Hydro City is my current, like, best Emerald thing. I mean, I don't know, that might be the soonest it's possible. I mean, I know in Sonic 2 you can get them all in Emerald Hill, but... Sonic 3, you might have to wait until Hydro City. Uh, okay. We Oh dear. Oh. I somehow came out of that unscathed. Okay, let's do a little bit of gambling before the direct starts. Maybe someday I'll stream this version of the game. I don't know. Be fun with the mods at least. Uh. Recording my reaction in case we get another buyless situation. So wait, what what were the three icons? Was it two Eggman it was it two Eggman and a jackpot? Well that means we're gonna hit the jackpot because Eggman's gonna be announced. Also, I sincerely hope we don't have another Violet situation. But... Sakurai has spit in the face of God before. Okay, we should probably, uh... We should probably vamoose now because it's about... It'll start any second now. Gen 8 Pokemon time. Oh, God. Oh God, don't remind me that that's possible. Don't, don't remind me. All right, see you later, Dr. Matt. I don't know whose choice it was, but it was a choice that I will regret for the rest of my days. Okay, here we go, here we go. Okay. Okay, hopefully it's not too loud. Okay, what do we got? Okay. Are we starting off? Is this Smash? Oh god. Xenoblade. We're not adding Xenoblade, are we? Xenoblade again. One day, Pyra just disappeared. She's the Welsh cat girl I keep hearing about. Okay, no, I think this is actually for Xenoblade. You guys like anime titties? We got some of those for you. I couldn't find it anywhere. It was as if she vanished off the face of all rest. I'm glad that British yeah. people are getting representation in RPGs now. Where have you gone? And the Welsh, apparently. I'll find you, whatever it takes. I don't think I've ever heard a Welsh accent in real life. This is where you were. Pyro! Oh no. Sorry, Rex. It is. It's Smash. I couldn't tell you. Because... I got an invitation to join Smash! Huh? Huh? I 
gonna be in Smash. Just sit back and leave it to me, Rex. Behold the power of the Aegis! Smash Flare! You powered up your Smash attack with fire? It's popular McJRPG man. Talk about a tight spot. Mithra? Let me handle this. Cutting it close, huh? Oh, hey, were these guys planning on me? Gee, I feel kind of bad now. Coming through! Lightning Buster! Who's on it? Ray is punishment! Through with us! Foresight! Whoa! You can even use that! You can swap between each other freely. Serious fight. Yep. Blinding speed. Yep. Together, nothing can stand our way. Quite the spectacle, aren't they? Wait, grumps? Can we can we add the horny police oh, to Smash? I thought it was for good boys and girls. Oh, look, our friends are here, and there's a boy. Expected to see you two again. Well, now that you're in Smash, I won't go easy on you. Ooh, fighting words. You forget. We're fighters too. Hello everyone, it's been a while. I'm Shinya Takahashi from Nintendo. Last year, we delivered some news through a series of Nintendo Direct mini presentations. Where was it? However, we haven't been able to present a Nintendo Direct in this style for some time. <laughs> I'm happy to share this Nintendo If the leak Direct I saw was accurate, then we're not going to be too thrilled by this either. So I hope it's not. We appreciate your continued support. Okay, what you just saw was the reveal trailer for the newest fighter in the Super Smash Bros. Ultimate game, Pyra and Mithra. They originally appeared in the Xenoblade Chronicles series as Rex's two-in-one ally. Please look forward to seeing their moveset in Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. This fighter releases in March, so we hope you'll stay tuned just a bit longer. All right, let's continue with our first batch of please, Nintendo we, Switch headlines. Can we just have something that's not anime, please? Oh, God. The, the leak might be accurate. Oh, no. It's Descend, gentlemen. I played a little bit of this, but I, I kind of lost interest astonishingly quickly. Stumble toward greatness when Fall Guys Ultimate Knockout comes to the Nintendo Switch system summer 2021. You have 22 minutes before the solar system is destroyed. Venture into the vast reaches of space to uncover the secrets left behind by an ancient civilization. 
You have 22 minutes. After that, the sun will explode and the solar system will be annihilated. However, everything will reset, allowing you to continue exploring while retaining information you gathered. So it's Majora's Mask. By repeating these cycles, you'll gradually unravel the mysteries hidden in the universe. I've seen this around a couple of times. What messages will you discover? How can you prevent the sun from exploding? Why is the solar system trapped in an endless time loop? I don't know. Why are you asking me? Find out when the critically acclaimed outer world. Okay, so it could be it could be legit. And if it is, there will be exactly one thing in here that I will get excited about. To the test in two classic murder mystery games. Famicom Detective Club, The Missing Air, and Famicom Detective <laughs> For some reason, I thought this was Stein's Gate. Two deep cuts from Nintendo history are coming to North America for the first time. Mm, I don't know that. I don't know if this was in it. Modernized for the Nintendo Switch system. Suspense, drama, and twists and turns await at every corner. Mm, unexpected. Seat as you dive into these deep narratives set in Japan. Also, there's like in a little game, reflection or like a line surrounding a wealthy going across my webcam while dealing with amnesia. Oh, this wasn't in the leak. Okay, well, good. But that's not the only case to crack. Because that means there might be something good in here. In the other game. You'll investigate a supernatural rumor after a mysterious I'm death sorry, my <laughs> my expectations nightmare. are just very abysmally low. Hunt for clues to piece together these chilling conundrums. <laughs> Can you figure out who the culprit is before it's too late? The schoolgirl had a trophy in melee. Interesting, interesting. <laughs> Uncover the deadly truth in Famicom Detective Club The Missing Heir and Famicom Detective Club The Girl Who Stands Behind. Coming to Nintendo Switch May Famicom 14. Detective Club Stardust Crusaders. A new age of battles begins. Long ago, a foolish samurai tried to defeat Aku. No bunga. Is is this his ambition? This direct has been very Japanese so far. The latest entry in the Samurai Warriors franchise is coming to Nintendo Switch. But I, I, I might have to get a new webcam Goku though if this keeps up because like I don't know, like the looks of that. And Mitsuhide Akechi. Character designs and visuals have been revamped for this installment. Unleash high octane moves in electrifying one versus one thousand battles. In Samurai Warriors Five. I mean, okay, on, Switch, on one, you can play as Link. On the other, you can't play as Link. The vast world of Fadiel beckons. Isn't that a name Ken Penders After came up with? After years, Legend of Mana featuring remastered HD graphics is coming to Nintendo Switch. You'll set off on a journey to find the mystical mana tree seen in a dream. Oh, this is this is some graphics clash Before right discovering here. The world map is empty. During your travels, you'll acquire we didn't items make the game artifacts. Place them on the map to bring towns, dungeons and other lands to life. It's up to you on when and where to place artifacts as well as how to advance the story. Join forces with characters, each on their own. I mean, it doesn't quests. look like awful graphically, but man, this is a, like a style disconnect. Or take a break from adventure Ooh, boy. and rest up at home. It looks somebody got. It looks like somebody got the Chrono Trigger characters and shoved them into Boy and His Blob on the Nintendo the Wii. And the original soundtrack. Other features have been added, including the ability to turn off enemy encounters, as well as the new minigame Ring Ring Land. The ability to not play the game. Legend also, the VMU. Nintendo Switch, June 24th.
Ah, oh, the sand shark. Capcom presents Beautiful Joe 3. I wish. Okay, so that's not that's not Dante. Is it Monster Hunter? It's usually Mon if I don't understand what it is, it's usually Monster Hunter. And there's like an armadillo dragon. Is you got Monster Hunter? Gotta be some variant. Almudron. Elder, I have important news. So it's finally beginning. Remember, son, Go dying is villages. gay. Fifty years ago, Kamuro Village was attacked by the Rampage and Magnum Malo. And we suffered some devastating casualties. How can we fight against that? Our hunter is about to face the biggest challenge. Maybe it's just like, you know, Fire Emblem and whatnot, but I am starting to get extremely turned off by like anime visuals plus poor <laughs> poor English dub. Maybe not poor, but over dramatic. I don't know, the characters look a little too uh, brightly colored to be Monster Hunter, I feel like. The Rampage. How long do you think it's going to last? I don't know, as long as Scum. Oh, it is Monster Hunter. As long as Scum Tech takes to, you know, get the antidote. We should start preparations right away. We're here to offer assistance. We must stop the calamity. Stop the calamity. And you, then we made a controller. That was the latest trailer for Monster Hunter Rise. You're right, mate, it sure was. How will our heroes fare against these ferocious monsters? Stay tuned for the latest installment in the Monster Hunter series, launching March 26th. Next, please take a look at this. Mario Golf! The is open once again. Tee off in the latest installment of the Mario Golf series, coming to Nintendo Switch. But it's plum in it. Study the wind and terrain. Take your time to think things through. Then swing. Listen, if I want to be impulsive, you can't stop me. Enjoy golfing with familiar Mushroom Kingdom characters on courses filled okay, well, with lush, natural scenery. I, I played Use the one on GameCube, but that was like about a it. Gauge to see how your shot will curve due to slopes. And a scan that lets you examine a course's terrain. These features can help you ace your shots. In addition to button controls, you can also use motion controls by holding a Joy-Con controller like a golf club. Gently swing the controller to have your character swing in the game, letting you easily enjoy the sensation of golfing. Oh, On top golf of where all you, that, you can run around. Several modes with new elements that truly bring the heat to Mario Golf. Including Ra this one. Race golf. golf. Here, it's always your turn. Everyone tees off at the same time, then you'll race through the course to reach your ball. Gotta go fast. Give it another whack to get it closer to the hole, then keep going. Outpace your opponents to come out on top. Your golfing skills aren't the only things at play. Make use of dashes and special shots to beat the competition. Oh, Wait. did we mention story uh. mode? As a me character, you're not you'll start plum. out as a rookie and develop your you're not even skills cherry. while interacting with various Mushroom Kingdom characters. Level up with experience points earned during matches. Then, allocate points to different stats, allowing you to develop your character however you'd like. You can also use Mario. your me in versus play. 
Put your golf yes, skills my to the game test is coming up Mario next. Mario Golf Super Rush swings onto Nintendo Switch June 25th. Pre-orders begin on they Nintendo were making my game after correct. this presentation. I was told that they were making my game. The latest game in the Mario Golf series adds new gameplay for multiplayer modes, as well as the familiar golf gameplay with easy-to-learn controls. This is a pretty cool game that I probably will not buy. Let's move on to more Nintendo Switch headlines. Alright. Check out these games coming to Nintendo Switch. Wait, where's Bowser? Why isn't he here? Return to the unforgiving world of Pandora in Tales from the Borderlands. Play as the Hyperion lackey Reese and the quick-witted con artist Fiona as you set out to recover a mountain Fiona. of Fiona! Set between Borderlands 2 and 3, this game includes all five Never played Borderlands. classic Borderlands humor. Gangsters, bandit lords, and vault hunters are just a handful of the obstacles you'll encounter in this choice-driven narrative adventure. Embark oh. on a wild ride when Tales Clap from the Borderlands will remember that. on Nintendo Switch, March 24th. 32 of Capcom's oh, yeah, I heard about this arcade one. classics are coming to Nintendo Switch. Rewind gameplay, adjust game speed or difficulty, and select from a variety of display options to relive that sweet arcade goodness. Get 1943 The Battle of Midway for free, then purchase game packs or the standalone Ghosts and Goblins add-on to build your collection. Local co-op play is also available. Scratch that nostalgic itch when Capcom Arcade Stadium launches later today. Ooh. Brains. As a zombie, you just can't get enough of it. In this action game from Aspire, you'll build your zombie horde and take revenge on the city. I like this guy. humans into your undead allies. Replenish your bodily arsenal of sputum head, gut grenades, and more during your grisly mission. This city ain't no match for a dead man. Stubbs the zombie in Rebel Without a Pulse eats its way onto Nintendo Switch March 16th. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. It's Travis touching oh, hey, Travis. assassins. Wait, aliens? Aliens have invaded Earth. Squid. Hold up, is this even the right game? <laughs> anyway, after annihilating an entire city, the aliens have taken over and now host an intergalactic superhero ranking tournament to decide Earth's fate. Here we go. As the crass beam katana wielding assassin Travis touchdown, you'll need to fight your way to the top to save the world. What's wrong? Hey, 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 not so fast. To enter each boss fight, you'll have to do some odd jobs around town and earn enough to pay off the entry fee. You'll then face off against a slew of unusual opponents. Most of them aliens with some crazy tricks up their sleeves. Study their tactics carefully to gain the upper hand in combat. With this a is a game series I probably need to try out at some point because I've, I've heard nothing but praise for it. And I do kind of like its style. So get ready to kick some... Uh, Whatever aliens have that you can kick. Anyway, it all makes sense. Isn't that a meme? No more heroes three lands. Whatever, whatever or aliens you. have instead of Nintendo butts. Switch, August twenty seventh. Expect some heavy swears. Oh yeah, of course. Exterminate demons in hell. Furry. Heaven. As above, so below. Why do they need assassins in heaven? <laughs> To do someone's dirty work. Is that the postal guy? Sign my petition. I I haven't smoked enough to do a good impression of the postal guy. Be the best there ever was. Or burn in hell. You know, I, I the first one sounds better to me, I think. You know, tough call, but generally speaking. Uncover Heaven's Mysteries in Neon White. Coming to Nintendo Switch. And it's interesting, I'll give it that. The DC Superhero Girls are here to save the day. Hi everyone, my name's Barbara Gordon. AKA Batgirl. I'm always inventing new gadgets to fight crime, like my batarangs and bat hook. 
Who's this super girl? She's super strong and has heat vision. <laughs> I have not a gotten enough wet. sleep for this. And let's not forget Wonder Woman, an Amazonian warrior who wields the sounds like Bubsy. Along with our friends Green Lantern, Bumblebee, and Zatanna, we fight evil supervillains to keep our city safe. But we're not just about the super life. We also have our school lives. And trust me, there's never a dull moment at Metropolis High School. Wait, this is like, Sometimes this is like gray, literally. Isn't it? Ooh, or gray, whatever. Gray Griffin. Griffin. That's her name now. That sounds like her. Justice later. Uh oh, something really bad is threatening the city. No one could have seen it coming. But when justice calls, persona for, for Babby. Answer, no, matter what. no, not just Babby. It's for Babby just girls. Make sure no one figures out our secret identities. See, we gotta DC make video. Girls, girls can't play power, video games, so we gotta make video games Nintendo specifically Switch for them. Board. You know, you understand how this works. Ready the juice can and prepare for battle. I like him. Oh. What is this? Plants versus zombies? Yep, yep. You saw his face. It, 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 that's what it is. Plant versus zombo. Is this plant versus zombies Fortnite? Platoon. That's what it looks like to me. Okay, so full disclosure, so far I have yet to be wowed. You know, maybe mildly impressed, but I have yet to see something that's like, ooh, yeah, I'm gonna get that. Nothing that's just made me like pull my wallet out and say like yes, yes, you can have it. Crash four continues to be uncontested. I mean, I don't know, it's been a year with just about no games. I hope they have something. Who will join you in your adventure? Okay. Th I, this was in the leak. Band together on a quest to face ah, so, evil and save Yeah, so this is what I was faces. talking about. Metopia HD. Metopia is coming to Nintendo Switch. Cast me characters in various roles across the kingdom. Turn your favorite people into your allies. Or Actually, even pretty happy about this. Dark lore. It's not a new Tamadachi life, but it's the next best thing, game. probably. Glam up your mies and get them ready for adventure. Oh wait, can you can you give them like you can give them There's like anime hair feature. in this one? Letting Stream wild with streams win as soon as I can get my hands on it. <laughs> in the world of Metopia, relationships are key. So consider spending some quality time with allies to strengthen bonds. I I played this uh, all the way through on battle. 3DS. And it was it was pretty good. It it's maybe not as good as Tamadachi, but it's still it's still pretty fun. Whoa! You can have a horse as an ally. That sounds pretty barn good. Care for it, and it'll lend a hand. Okay, so that's new. That wasn't in the original. Venture with friends and familiar faces in the lighthearted romp of Utopia. So I'm guessing this is like a deluxe version of the original game. Does this mean we have to port all the islanders to Switch? I can probably just transfer them over with uh amiibo. Super Mario themed items are coming to your island. Oh boy. Super Mario Brothers 35th anniversary themed items are coming to the Animal Crossing New Horizons game. Hey Mario! Familiar items like the super mushroom and the question block can be ordered in game as furniture items. Ooh. So place them Neat. however Neat. and wherever you'd like. Oh, Wario. They're going to announce my game Warpike. next. I was told that my game is next. Then use them to travel between locations Ooh. on your island. Actually practical. Hey, why not try recreating the mushroom kingdom? No Waluigi. <laughs> That's a good one. A free update for the game launches February 25th. After downloading it, Super Mario Brothers items will be available via <laughs> I don't have this game, but I want a refund anyway. 
Keep an eye on the official animal You better believe I'm going to dress up as Wario, though. In celebration of his game, which is coming up next. I hope you continue enjoying life on your island. How was that? These okay. collaboration items will be released as part of the Super Mario Brothers 35th anniversary events. Please wait a bit longer for their release. Not like I have a choice, though. Speaking of which, last week, we had the global launch for the Super Mario 3D World plus Bowser's Fury game. We hope you enjoy that Mario adventure as well. Next, we have another game to show you. Wario Land 6. Oh no. I'm this th this whole thing just smacks of anime. Oh, yep, there it is. There's the anime. Looks like anime Anakin Skywalker. This is this is Fire Emblem. This is Fire Emblem. Oh, never mind. He leaves us no recourse. Swords. Oh, <laughs> more like weird pixel art fusion. I thought this was gonna be three houses because of the three, the three thing. Raised earth and burnt corpses. You and no other must decide how we proceed. I know that voice. You are a leader and must be the beacon others look to when the night is darkest. Together with these fields, today you burn. Is this is this like a new trend I that I was not aware of? Is just RPGs with pixel characters in non-pixel situations? Triangle strategy. Far, far uh, away yes, excellent title. Norzilia, comprised of three nations and limited deposits of salt and iron. <laughs> The constant feuds among the That's going to be a meme. Precious is resources eventually limited amounts of salt known as the Salt Iron War. Though That's the war I'm going to engage in if I don't get Eggman. Decades later, the flames of war threaten to engulf the realm once again. If one of these isn't Rayman or, or Rayman, Eggman or Crap, I would have taken Rayman. I don't know. I just feel like there's a very unbalanced anime to not anime ratio. Powers that would orchestrate their downfall. Our benefit, you say? Hmm, actually pretty decent yellow In paint. This new tactical RPG battles take place on terrain with different elevations. I'm starting to figure out why this is 50 minutes. Is determined by their location and their equipped weapon. The range can be extended by attacking from oh, Okay, so it's so it's like a strategy thing. Weapons, such as bows and arrows. Thus, your forces can use the terrain and other We still have 20 minutes left. The upper hand. <laughs> But how much of it's going to be this? Not only to your initial attack, but also a powerful blow from the ally positioned behind the enemy. What have we here? Charge into an enemy to send them flying into position for a follow-up attack. We win. Link attacks together by first casting ice magic on the flames to create water terrain. <laughs> This is starting to become a pet peeve of mine, like, lightning magic. like, okay, I, I understand, you know, you want to show what the game is about, but do you have to read the entire strategy guide to me? Uh, choices and consequences are my, is my favorite soap opera. In a variety of situations. Nintendo Power died for this? Morality, liberty. Collectively, your decisions will establish your conviction, affecting how the story unfolds and who will join your cause. Once more, I would ask you plainly: Do we Benedict do Cumberbatch relinquish Prince Roland to Estrost? Critical decisions that may determine the fates of nations are settled by vote on the scales of conviction. Yeah, America. Use information you've gathered to sway allies toward your favored cause. The story will significantly change based on how the votes are cast. So they refuse Interesting. to relinquish Interesting. Us. Lies! His hand was forced. As more and more critical decisions are made, your journey may take you down paths divergent from those of other players. You will see what true might is.
All of these doves have like the Project same Triangle feel to them. Strategy, a brand new tactical RPG from Square Enix. Will oh, it's Square in Enix. Please I'm still gonna say Enix. For more information in the future. After this presentation, you a can't demo stop version me. of this game will be available to download on Nintendo uh, eShop. And in the future, kinda don't we'll care. conduct a survey to gather players. It looks fine. Kinda don't we care look though. Forward to hearing your responses. <laughs> like I don't I don't wanna I don't wanna like you know Please I don't wanna tell you nothing. updates on this brand new tactical RPG from Square Enix. Okay, let's see a few more Nintendo Switch headlines. Give me Wario! Calling all hunters. Do you have what it takes? Star War? Why is there a Star War? Is George Lucas gonna take my VOD down? You're my brother, Anakin! Oh, okay. Okay, nice Star trailer. Star Wars Hunters is a competitive free-to-play online game set between episodes uh, six and seven. Competitive free-to-play person shooter coming to Nintendo mm -hmm. Switch. Why is the logo neon? All right, let's do this. All right, Sal. <laughs> do I look at you or the camera? Knockout City interviews. Take one. What? We all play for different reasons. Mm. Corgan love battle. Corgan it, use many weapons. Is Triple EA making their own Smash Brothers? Misery, Hades soul devouring crossbow. A princess is supposed to lead her people, not be stuck up in some tower waiting for a okay. hero. I like this pixel work. art though. Well, constantly was in past I like animated Long pixel sword, art lady. Blade of Doom. Just once, just once, I'd like to catch one of them bullets. You know, with. My hands. With this crown, I'm gonna lead my team to victory and kick some serious ass. <laughs> Look, it's you know what would be neat City, is like a Roger West. Rabbit movie, but with bullets. pixel art characters instead. Oh, is it Fortnite? Is it, oh, it's dodgeball. What? Oh, she's not. She's not 2D pixel in the game. I, I my disappointment is immeasurable, and my day is ruined. Or she's not actually in this game. In but then which in which case why is she in the trailer? You have confused me, EA. So if she was 2D, were you going to buy it? No, but I would have been slightly brick. <laughs> Sportsman. More British voices. I mean, yeah, you guys are getting some rip today. I mean, so are we, because you know that guy there. You know, he's saying, hello. 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 The fight for survival starts now. Pokemon 2. Hang on tight, because you're all going to play a little game of fate for me. No, the Dong. The creators of the Danganronpa and Zero Escape series uh, comes a fight for your life. Okay, Literally, so it's Danganronpa, but not. An underwater theme park. The 12 of you, known as the Go-Getters Club, must now survive this game of fate at all costs. I don't want to die yet. So it's so Danganronpa, but everybody looks like they're from Pokemon. Okay. The game is suddenly called off. You escape the theme park and get a glimpse of Japan, but everyone's vanished. Set off on a captivating oh, okay, journey. Okay, so it's Dongan Rampa, except Dongan Rampa doesn't happen. Narrative. The one behind the whole game of fate. As you make your way back home to Tokyo, you'll alternate between working solo and teaming up with the group to overcome challenges and monsters that stand in your way. What awaits you all at the end of your journey? The battle. Why can't we get an anime character in Smash that looks like this? Onto Nintendo Switch. Why do they all got to look like, you know that? <laughs> Wield the powers of Olympus with the physical release of Hades. Ah, uh, is he trying Hades, to win Hades? Dungeon crawler and recipient of multiple Game of the Year awards is getting a physical release on Nintendo Switch. This version comes with a couple of extras to assist you on your journey out of the underworld. 
The first is a PC download code for the Hades original soundtrack. I mean, I've it's heard good things about that. Blood pumping music don't, I don't really know Cole. if I want to play it, but I've heard good things about it. Super giant titles like Transistor and Bastion. The second is a 32-page full-color character compendium featuring portraits of the game's vibrant cast of gods, ghosts, and monsters, all by Supergiant's art director, Gen Z. And let's not forget the game itself. Okay, thank you, motorcycle of dude. Of exhilarating action paired with a compelling story. Escape the underworld again, or for the first time, with the physical version of Hades on March 19th. Three deadly action games. Ooh, one Ninja Gaiden. Collection. Ninja Gaiden Sigma. Ninja Gaiden Sigma 2. But when Ninja do I get Gaiden the NES Razor's Ninja Gaiden Edge games? Are, mm -hmm. to Switch mm -hmm. as the action are, are Ninja any of those on NSO collection. yet? I don't actually remember. You are the legendary ninja Ryu Hayabusa, fighting against a great evil with battle skills that are second to none. Wield an arsenal of killer weapons, each offering a playstyle with different set of lethal skills, along with ruthless ninjutsu to swiftly take down enemies. I mean, I'm sure it's pretty good, but I'm, I'm always going to be more for the NES games myself, just based on my taste. Oh, there's a, the, more more anime titty. All previous downloadable content, including costumes and game modes, are included. Nintendo is especially horny today. Ninja Gaiden in one dynamic collection. I know this isn't their game, Ninja but they're Gaiden presenting Master it. Collection slices its way onto Nintendo Switch Summer 2021. More battles are coming to Hyrule Warriors Age of Calamity. I never ended up picking this. I I mean, I think I picked up Hyrule Warriors on 3DS, but that's it. And I never actually played it. Egg. When are you gonna add Groose, you cowards? There's even more coming to Nintendo Switch. Bravely Default 2 is almost here. I, th I thought this game Four came out like life. years ago. On a journey to restore the crystals. Or no wait, no wait, it was it was Bravely Second, which sounds like it's it sounds like it's this, but it's not. Battles. Veterans and That's a good sign when I mistake your game for your other game. February 26th. A new trailer for Bravely Default 2 will be revealed following this presentation. The game can be pre-ordered like a on Wonder Nintendo Boy kind of situation. The demo is also available. The latest installment in the legendary Ghosts and Goblins series comes to life. This looks like it could be fun, but my god, I am not a fan of the graphical style. Monsters across challenging stages within the it, it, it legitimately Local looks like a flash game. For the first time, help Arthur in his quest with one of three supporting characters. Barry for defense, Carrie for transportation, or Archie for bridges. Why couldn't this guy Ghosts be in Smash? Resurrection launches February 25th. Pre-orders are available now on Nintendo eShop. No, we gotta add JRPG McCool Man. Eight protagonists. What art Eight style would you have preferred? Sonic Frontier has been remastered for Nintendo Switch. Travel through a stunning sci-fi world. Wait, what is this? I, I looked away. Their own stories. With the addition of the playable protagonist. Again, views, it's kind of new gameplay just, features, exhilarating battles. Kind of graphics and clash. Scenario for the protagonist Acellus. Saga Frontier Remastered is an adventure. Oh, Saga Frontier. The game launches April 15th. Just very graphics Apex clash. Apex Legends is storming onto the Nintendo oh, Switch boy. system. This free-to-play battle royale features a growing roster of powerful contenders named Legends, strategic combat, cross-platform play, and more. All players on Nintendo Switch can get an all-new Legendary Pathfinder skin and 30 free levels for the Season 8 Mayhem Battle Pass. Plus, for the first two weeks after launch, earn double XP when you play on Nintendo Switch. Fight for fortune, fame, and glory when Apex Legends enters the fray March 9th. How's it going so far? Not so good. There's still a little bit more to show you in today's Nintendo Direct, so we hope you'll stick with us. Next, 
Please take a look at this. Please tell me you saved the best for last. Ooh. Hello there. I'm they Asian might have. Numa, producer of the Legend of Zelda series. They might have. I'm sure a lot of you saw me and thought there might be news about the sequel to the Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild game. Was well, there? Unfortunately, we don't have anything to share right now. God. <laughs> we apologize. Development is proceeding smoothly, and we should be able to bring you some new information this year. For now, we'll have to ask you to wait just a bit longer. While you're all waiting, however, this Legend of Zelda game will be coming to Nintendo Switch. Ooh, what Please is it? take a look. Ooh, what is it? What is it? Oh my god, it is Skyward Sword. <laughs> Groose will be loose once again. Okay, hot take. I actually like Skyward Sword. It's not the best Zelda game, but I did like it. And being able to play it without, you know, the Wii Remote and stuff in HD would probably be nice. <laughs> Thank you, Gira him. Can I get Wind Waker, though? Can I get Wind Waker and Twilight Princess, too? What you've just seen is The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword HD. This game originally released in 2011 on the Wii console. I was okay with Skyward Nintendo Sword's Switch. controls, except for when you had to go like... The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword featured a control scheme in which players would use the Wii Remote Plus controller as a sword and the Nunchuck controller as a shield. With the increased processing power of the Nintendo Switch system, the controls here are smoother and even more intuitive. And we've recreated the controls for the sword and the shield here by having the player hold two Joy-Con controllers. I, I figured. The uh, controller can you the fix my drift though? Before this comes out. To have Link swing his sword in the game. The Joy-Con controller in your left hand is the shield. By lifting the controller, you can raise the shield to block enemy attacks. You can perform other actions like using both controllers to wield a bow and arrow. These physical movements add a sense of urgency and tension to combat. Robo pirate. But we've also made it possible to play the game with button controls to ensure it can be played in handheld mode or on the Nintendo Switch Lite system. Okay. After mulling over how to assign different gameplay elements to different buttons, we decided to apply the sword motions to tilting the right control stick. Probably the best way they could have done it, honestly. Tilt the stick down when you want to swing the sword downward. To swing to the right, to the left, or diagonally, just tilt the stick in the respective direction. Seems good. There's something else we've been working on. Seems good. Specially designed Joy-Con controllers. Those are pretty. The right Joy-Con controller is themed after the Master Sword, while the left features a Hylian Shield motif. Hylian Shield looks Skyward better, Sword, I'm gonna be real with you. the game depicting the earliest story in the Legend of Zelda timeline details the events around the creation of the Master Sword itself. We hope that people who played the original game on Wii and those playing it for the first time will enjoy discovering the origins of the Legend of Zelda. Well, when I eventually get to that point, that's probably how I'll Legend play it. Legend of Zelda it. Skyward Sword HD launches July 16th. Following right around my Nintendo birthday, Direct, too. You'll be able to pre order the game on Nintendo eShop. And the specially designed Joy Con controllers will launch on the game's release date at your But we got a retailers. long way to go. The Switch 3 will probably be out by that point. The Skyward Sword was the last original console game prior to the Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild game, and it was still following the established conventions of the Legend of Zelda. However, it gave a glimpse into many features and innovations that would eventually be adopted in the Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Using the sailcloth to descend in midair, a stamina gauge that depleted as you scaled walls with vines or ran. Even the concept of collecting items to upgrade gear. Please get rid of the, the, the item of message, of please. The we'll give this game a try as well. If you change one thing about this game, please get rid of that. Please look forward to The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword HD. Can I get Wind Waker, though? Can I get that, too? Well, what did you think? 
the probably the best thing so far. Sword has been optimized for Nintendo Switch. It includes intuitive motion controls and button controls by tilting the right control stick. But then is that really okay, a button? The next game will be our last announcement for today. Wario Please Land. Take a look at this. Come on. It's not going to be Wario Land. Uh, Tatooine. Oh, it's Squid. Squid Game. Splatoon 3. Yeah, all right. Ah, uh, customize the whatever that is. Everyone's dead. Oh, it's the Eiffel Tower. Okay. I mean, it's this is something. Back into the ink. Back into the stink. What you've just gets seen one thumbs up. Not two, but ju series, just just the one. Three. This game is scheduled to launch in 2022, so it'll be a while. We hope you'll stay tuned for more information at a later time. Today, we showed you a sampling of games coming to Nintendo Switch. A variety of games are in development. Mm, finally. And we look forward to sharing more news with you in the future. That's all for today's Nintendo Direct. Thank you for watching. <clears throat> all right, so uh, if I can tell the truth, and I have a little underwhelming, uh, didn't expect Splatoon 3. Uh, I probably will play it, and it's, you know, probably be good, but I can't say it's a series, you know, I'm excited about. So it, it kind of says a lot that the thing I was most excited for in this direct was Skyward Sword. Yeah, so, I mean, hey, when I, like I said, when I get to that point, when we work our way up the Zelda ladder and we eventually get to Skyward Sword, that's probably how I will play it. But I guess, you know, until then, don't worry about it. Uh, I kind of disappointed about Pyra and What's-Her-Face being the new Smash character because it just, 
like I said, nothing against Xenoblade. It just, I don't know. These characters are starting to feel a little stagnant. But maybe I'm just the guy who wants, you know, Bipple Scringus from the platformer games. You know, I don't know. I don't know. I'm just, uh, personally me, I'm just not into it. <laughs> I probably won't protest it like I did Byleth and just not buy it, but I can't say it's something that's going to make me flock to the eShop right away. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, Skyward Sword and Miitopia were the highlights. I forgot, I actually forgot about Miitopia, I'm sorry. <clears throat> And they are kind of just ports of other games, which is not a good sign. Hopefully they'll have more things in later in the year, but I, if I can be honest with you, for like a year and a half of no directs, I was, you know, I was hoping for a little bit more. I won't lie to you. I, you know, I was hoping for something a bit more substantial. Like, I, I, I mean, I knew ultimately we weren't going to get a Wario Land or anything. It's been like 10 years since the last one and I mean I I joke around about it but it, it does feel kind of true that it's like if you got to be Mario Zelda Fire Emblem or Pokemon if you want to get it if you want Nintendo to make a game about you in 2021 Captain Falcon uh, you know Wario all that stuff they can go to hell Oh, okay. <laughs> Just cut off. But yeah, uh, probably will do a stream of Metopia. It won't be blind. I've played the 3DS version, but it will, you know, and it, it looks like it'd be fun. It'd be fun to go through it, you know, with, you know, on stream now that I am capable of doing so. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Like I said, hopefully we, we hear about some more substantial things later in the year. But personally I wasn't I wasn't terribly impressed is my is my takeaway from this. Some some good things, some things I'm glad to see, but nothing nothing that wowed me. You know, nothing that had me go like <sighs> you know what I mean? I don't know. Well, that's probably all I got for right now. Um, if you want to discuss anything that happened in this stream, you know, I'm on Discord. You know, you can talk to me there. Uh, I got my own server if you feel like it, but I'm also in other ones. So if you, if you have me there, then whatever. I understand. I understand. Well, I'll see you.